think I'm doing my hair. <laughs> I just need a break. I seriously just need a break. So I am going to flat iron my hair. Yes, I'm going to put heat on my hair because, like I said, I just need a break. Um, I'm sick of doing my hair, y'all. Real life, I'm sick of doing my hair. The weather is changing. It's getting dark early. It, it just, it's too much. I need something different for now. Um, and I said I was not going to straighten my hair until December. What is that? Gel residue, great. So I wasn't gonna straighten my hair until December, but I've changed my mind. I just, I just can't do it. Just can't. Sorry. Not sorry. Cause ain't none of y'all gonna come here and do this hate. Hey this is a lot of hair, y'all. It's a lot of work. So I'm gonna just quickly show you when I when my hair is like this in a wash and go. Um, what I typically do for detangling before I always detangle a little bit before I get in the shower so I'll start with the front and just like I said quickly show you guys what I am going to do oh. just wanted to come back I feel like this would be a good time to show you guys a texture shot before I flat iron my hair and this is just the Ozzy Moist conditioner um, there is some Camille Rose in my hair so I'm sure that's being like reactivated or something but yeah that's just a quick little texture shot I'm so excited for my hair to be straight for a while let's just chit chat let's do that so a lot of people have been either sending me emails or um, different forms of social media have been asking me questions kind of about my life. Um, we are fairly private, so some stuff I feel like is just a little bit too personal. Um, but other questions, yeah, I don't mind answering. So I'll do that real quick. I am 32 years old. I have three kids, 10, six, and 10 months. I am married. I've been married for um, a little bit over a year, not even a little bit. Going on two years actually, I've been married. We've been together for nine years. And I did go to college. Um, right after college, I got a government job, worked for the government for seven years, and uh, then we decided that it would be beneficial for me to be a stay-at-home mom, and knowing that we wanted more kids and all of that, so I decided to, I should say we, my husband and I decided that I would be a stay-at-home mom, and I have been a stay-at-home mom for three years now I was gonna say two years but it's been three years um, and it's been absolutely amazing it is a blessing uh, to be able to you know raise my kids and see the daily milestones of our baby and volunteer at my kids school all of that so let's see what else does somebody ask me about siblings I have three older sisters and one younger brother I am the youngest clearly of the girls um, probably the brat of the family I'm very much a daddy's girl I talk to my dad like I don't know five times a day um, so we're really really close I'm really close to my oldest sister as well not oldest I'm sorry um, my the second oldest sister I'm very close to her. She is uh, a lot like a mother figure to me. I my hair. So I'm just going to squeeze out some of the excess water. I'm going to apply some of my Keratin Complex Infused Therapy. This is also a heat protectant. Um, where did I get this from? 
Ulta. And I got it a while ago, actually, but it lasts a long time. Just gonna apply a few pumps like that to each section of my hair and blow dry it. In the morning, I will um, flat iron it and that's it for tonight. I wish I could wear it like this. Like I think if I had somewhere to go, I would, but this is something that would literally happen for the day and that was it because after that it would be froed up but you can kind of see how it's cut in the layers you have it here and then you have it here and then you have it here see how it's staggered and that's what happened when i got my diva cut um which i love by the way so yeah it's time for bed i'm gonna just put it in some plaits real quick and flat out in the morning so i'll see you guys tomorrow good night it's morning my hair um don't laugh y'all don't laugh so i started out doing plaits but my hands naturally just want to twist all the time because that's what i do on a regular basis and so I have plaits over here, and I have twist over here. <laughs> I don't know. I was like, yeah, you know, whatever. So that's what I have going on. I'm going to actually start, I'm gonna start on the back. The flat iron I'm going to be using is my chi iron. This is the same flat iron that I've been using. It's kind of worn. I have to show you the box. But this is the same one that I've been using for years. Um, it is my go-to flat iron. Here's the box. I got it from Ulta like five, six years ago. I mean, I've had it for a really long time. So I put oil on my hair last night. I put heat protectant on my hair last night. I am not going to apply anything else to my hair. I'm just going to section it and flat iron it. To make sure my flat iron is hot enough, I always do this. Because I can feel the heat. And so it just, that is what I do. Um, so a couple tops at the top. I am going to do the chasing method. And this little tool, I want to say I got it from Sally's. It's okay. It actually, um, it melts. I don't know if you guys can see that. You see that? Like, I had it too close to the flat iron, I guess, and kind of melted off. So I'm going to put the comb on and just run it through. You see that smoke? That's what happens. My hair is not burning. Trust me. If it was burning, I would stop. Um, so I actually am probably going to be able to get away with just one pass, but I didn't go all the way to the end, so I'm going to have to go all the way to the end. And there you have it. So I can see some of the single strand knots at the bottom, but it's pretty straight. Back up a little bit. And let's do another section. So if you look, my sections are not very big at all. And part of the reason, what kind of helps me, uh, what am I trying to say? What helps me part them is when I braid my hair, it naturally creates sections. And so I try to go based off of those. I'm having a hard time, clearly. So same thing, move this one out the way. I'm going to just kind of comb through it a little bit. Tap the roots. And apply my chasing comb. And this time go all the way to the ends. like literally saw a knot at the end of my hair. Look at that, you see it right there? 
You see that? Okay, so now I'm at the very front. And because I've examined this section and I see that there aren't very many single strand knots at all, I'm going to run through it and instead of straightening it all the way, I'm going to twist my flat iron and make a curl. See? So it puts a curl at the end of my hair. And then I will do the same to this section. And this will just help my hair kind of frame my face a little bit better. Oops. That sucks, you guys couldn't see that. Okay, so I have also applied my Argon Oil from Antoine Couture. Love this stuff. All I did was do like a little squirt like that and just kind of run it on my hair to lay down some of the flyaways. And it's very light, so I don't have to worry about it messing and frizzing up my hair. And then I'm going to kind of section my hair with my fingers so I can pop a couple curls in there. Alright guys, all done. I have lots of bounce. My curls will stay and I will wrap my hair. My hair hasn't been straightened so long and I'm loving it. It's so full. Love it. It's funny, I look like my sister. <laughs> like a lot like my sister when my hair is straight. So yeah, my hair will be straight for the next, shoot, at least the next month. All this heat I didn't put in my hair. Alright guys, if you have any questions, let me know down in the description box. If you have any questions, let me know in the description box below. Pretty easy. It took me about an hour to flat iron my hair. And I am loving the results. Hope you guys enjoy this video. See you next time.